Hello there, it's Penny today from Trahim Game Channel. I'm going to teach you how to uh, use your PSVR in PC to play uh, games of Steam. For this uh, demonstration, I'm going to work with uh, EVI, but I'm going to give you other examples that you can have in the system. So, see my logo. After that, I'm going to do these steps with you. Hello, I'm back. Here in my screen, I have a Hibai driver uh, app in at Steam. Okay, um, I'm going to use this app because it's almost plug and play. I'm going only to plug the cables. I'm going to see, and uh, almost everything works perfectly. And this, I think, is the cheaper uh, way to play uh, PSVR uh, in PC. The other options we have two more options now. Actually, now we have uh, three more. We have Trinos VR. Well, it's very good, but uh, uh, it has some problems because it has a lot of options for the user. For the end user, you can have some problems compared with EVI. We have a Nolo VR. You can go to the website Nolo VR. And you can download the app and it's free and you can use your psvr and we have now an option with drive for vr it's another very good option you can use i can do another video later this is the drive for vr uh, also now you have in on steam before we we had to do uh, to download it uh, outside of Steam, but now you can do it in Steam. But uh, what well, it's a very good option also because I tested it almost a plug and play also, and you have all the options to use controls. Okay, you can use the pass move control if you have the PS4 camera or Kinect, uh, for instance, the PS4 camera. Uh, I have read tested with the PS4 camera and the, the PS moves work very, very well using a uh, PS move servers. I can show you another video yet. But let's go to the steps now for installing PSVR. Okay, I'm going to use EVI as I told you. So let's go now uh, talk about the processors. Uh, in the processor, it's almost, uh, the, the, almost the same step that you do in your PS4 or PS5. Okay, uh, we, here we have uh, HDMI uh, entrance that you, you need to plug the cable, HDMI cable comes from the PC. Okay, here I have the cable. This cable is from PC. I'm going to link as you do uh, in PS4. Okay. The another cable you have here is the USB cable. Uh, you need to plug in a SB. Uh, I give a device you to plug in a SB 2.0. Okay, I'm going to plug. I have already tried to do it in, in 3.0. Sometimes I had some problems. And uh, now the, the this part you need to plug uh, your uh, the headset. Okay, and now you need to turn on. Uh, your PSVR, okay? Let's go. I'm going to turn on and now let's go to the EVI driver. Okay, I'm back. Before to begin uh, and to use EVI or Trinos, Nolo VR or Drive for VR, you need to install Steam VR app. Okay, this app uh, uh, allows you to play in VR and use headsets like PSVR, Oculus, Mixed Realities, I get the Vive. Okay, if, if you don't install, the apps is, are not going to work, okay? Now let's go to EVI. I have already installed uh, Steam VR. Uh, now I have read, let me turn on my PSVR. I turn on. And now I'm going to begin Steam VR. First option on the EVI. Sorry. Let's see. And I'm going to give you a tip. Okay, the lights uh, turn on. Let's see inside the. Oh, it's working. It's working pretty well. Okay, I think you are, you are seeing my screen. Uh, turn on a uh, big picture. 
Now I have big picture. It's I enjoy a lot the screen. Okay. I'm going to give you a tip. Uh, before you start the drive by, let the PSVR on the floor, okay? On a table. Don't move it. Okay, because the when you start a Vi driver or other app like Trinos No VR or Drive for VR, when we start the system begin to calibrate this the PSVR in the PC. The other uh, other uh, advice I can I can give you. Let me show you. You have here task taskbar and you have an app, the Vi driver. So you have some options here that you can use with uh, your device you can change your frame rate i don't change it the you can configure the lane distortion ipd uh, it, it is the distance from eye to eye okay this psvr doesn't have here uh, a manual ipd adjustment so you can use it as a software my one is like 66 millimeters and uh, tracking okay no ah this tracking uh you can use it psvi is going only to work in this uh movement okay this movement in this movement here the head if you want this movement here want uh, to front uh in, in back you need to use an, another techniques like uh pass move here in PS Move Service, you can use Kinect with Drive for VR. Uh, you can use the camera. Now you can use Drive for VR with camera of uh, uh, PS4. And here you have uh, handheld resolution. I don't change, okay? It's working pretty, pretty well. Now you can go on again. I have other uh, tips that uh, sometimes it doesn't work. And I can give you on the description, for instance, uh, if you have. Uh, if you, you plug your USB, it doesn't work. You can you can go to your device management manager. I'm going to show you. For instance, now I am in my device manager, and the, you can choose an option here to show the hidden uh, devices. For instance, these ones here, my USBs that they, they are not working. When uh, what happened when you plug in a USB? Sometimes it doesn't work. You're going to I want to receive a message here. USB is not working, like X. And you on one option is you to plug in another USB. Another option is, is to come here in device manager and delete all the white ones, okay? Not the black ones, like this one, okay? And the, uh, in general, it works. Uh, the USB is going to work again. So now it's red and now you can go you can play your steam vr games i'm going to use this uh, video for to play race car games dcs and uh, ride simulator so thank you very much and i see you in the next video subscribe my channel and I give you a like and i see you in the next video thank you very much